Hi, I'm Wade from Thoroughbred Diesel, and today we've got a carnage video for you. Two thousand fifteen F250 6.7 liter power stroke truck brought in the shop today. Customer put two and a half gallons of DEF fluid into his fuel tank. Oof, it's gonna hurt kids. So we want to talk about a couple of different aspects on this before we really get into the technical side of it. Um, first off, when you're at the, the pump, and this goes into putting gas in your truck, into your diesel, or diesel into your, your gasoline vehicle, um, when you're at the pump and you're doing stuff like that, you've got to take your time. Uh, you've got to be aware of what's going on because if you make this mistake, it's going to cost you a lot of money to fix it. Uh, hopefully, you know, if you have, if you do what this customer did, if you put DEF in your fuel, hopefully, hopefully you figure it out while you're while you're doing it and you're able to stop at that point and then just drop your tank and clean it out um, and you don't drive unfortunately this customer drove so it's going to cost him a set of injectors the injection pump and a complete new low side fuel system so let's talk about what def does when it gets into fuel so we got a couple of our good kentucky moonshine mason jars out here and we did a couple of uh, beakerish experiments for you now adam is uh adam our film guy he uh he actually is a biology major. Uh, I'm a dumb technology major in college, so um, you know I, I'm just here for the. Uh, I was just there for the free booze. But um, that being said, Adam has kind of educated me on some of the the things that go on um, when you have the introduction of DEF into your fuel. So what I wanted to do, as my first jar here. I just wanted to show you what water and fuel do when they're mixed together. So we've got equal parts of water and fuel here, just good clean diesel fuel. You shake that up, uh, they'll mix. Uh, obviously, uh, diesel fuel um, will emulsify, or the, the water will emulsify, whichever one does it, and they separate, they become two different liquids. You have a separation there inside of liquids. Uh, although it's not good to get water in your fuel, um, it's something that you can actually get out of it. Um, you know, hopefully it doesn't make it into your high side fuel system. We'll call your injectors and your injection pump. Uh, hopefully you, if it's in a water separator, you can just drain the water off and go on about your merry way. DEF is a little bit different. Uh, I use the word soluble. Uh, DEF is soluble in the fuel. Adam corrected me and told me that that probably wasn't the right thing, but I'm going to tell you what it is. DEF is a contaminant in your fuel and it's through your fuel. So now this is a fuel sample out of this guy's fuel tank. You can see how cloudy the fuel is. Uh, it's very, very cloudy. So you've got DEF mixed in with that fuel. So it's its own funky liquid that's no good for anybody. If you look in the lower corner there, you can see the DEF solid portion of that already starting to separate itself out. It's very white. Uh, it is actually a solid, uh, for lack of a better word, that is in that fuel system. So there is a little bit of separation there um, between the two. Here's the thing. DEF is a contaminant, first off. It's abrasive. It takes away all the lubricity out of the fuel, so it is going to wreck your high side fuel system. So if you are, if you think that, hey, I put some DEF in my fuel tank, I'm just going to put some fresh fuel on top of it. I'm going to run it and see what happens. I'm going to tell you what's going to happen. If you run it, it's not going to be a good outcome for you. Even a little bit of fuel, even a little bit of DEF. Stop. Put the truck on a, put your truck on a tow truck. Take it to a shop. Have the truck, have the tank dropped. Have it all cleaned out. Get everything, all the DEF out of it before you go any farther. Because we don't want to see you put it through your, um, through your fuel system and and it become a several thousand dollar job versus several hundred dollars if you don't uh, run it through the high side fuel system. Now, one thing that people don't remember when they do this, if you pour DEF in your tank don't turn your key on because when you, as soon as you turn the key on your lift pump if the truck's got a lift pump on it's going to pick the fuel up and it's going to run it all the way through your low side fuel system it's even going to introduce it to the entrance of the high side fuel system the injectors and the injection pump so you're going to want to make sure that you don't do that ford tells you in this instance they want you to go ahead and drop the tank fill the tank back full of clean diesel fuel change out your filters unhook unhook your low side fuel line from your uh, from your fuel cooler and run it for three minutes Minutes until you get or you get three gallons of fuel run through it to clean out everything on the low side fuel system. So um, here's a shot of the customer's fuel filter. You can see the DEF kind of starting to set up as a solid in there. 
no good. This is a very dirty fuel filter anyway. He needed to change this, but um, some more of the DEF that's been exposed, a little bit more oxygen here. You can see it's starting to crystallize inside of this cup. If you can see that, bad, bad deal. Bad deal. This is gonna be expensive for this customer, but we wanna make you aware of it. And just take a couple extra minutes when you're at the fuel pump. Make sure you understand what you're doing. Make sure you're not at the gasoline pump. Make sure you're not putting DEF into your fuel tank. These new trucks, the DEF, the DEF entrance is right beside of the fuel inlet or the fuel tank fill up. So very easy to do. Chevrolet guys, it's underneath the hood, so um, you don't have that. But be aware of it. Be very careful. It can get very expensive for you. I'm Wade from Third Bread Diesel. If you've got any questions about any of our videos or if you have a question about your truck, please give us a call, like, and subscribe to our channel.